Hi, I'm Kian, and in this video, I'm going to show you how um, to use calculus to solve this physics problem. So we have this problem. A spring has a natural length of 1 meter, and a force of 25 newtons stretches the spring by 1 fourth of a meter. Determine how much work is done by stretching the spring uh, 2 meters beyond its natural length. So basically, what we're dealing with, we have a work function that I'm going to write it as basically w and you have to consider that the work is basically force times displacement or the integral of the force function which i'm going to call f of x um, from a to b or over kind of a displacement from a position a a to a position b and so in this case we're uh, dealing with a um a spring and so we technically want to use hook's law and we know that the f of x or the force function basically uh, is k, which is a constant of um, at the spring, and times x, which is basically a displacement. It's just kx. And so what we're given is that the force is 25 newton, so the f of x is 25, and the displacement is stretched by one fourth a meter. So basically we have k over 4, because x is one fourth. And so multiplying 4 on both sides, we get that k, or the spring constant, is 100 um, and um, therefore uh, we can use the fact that f of x or the force function in this case is uh, k times x which is 100x but we're not done because we want to find the work done and so work done is basically the integral of force and so what we're going to do is that uh, or the work, uh, 2 meter is going to be the integral, and then from 0, which is the original position, to 2 of 100x, and then uh, we take it to dx because it's, that's the variable, um, and then integrating 100x, we get um, 50x squared, and then uh, from 0 to 2, we get 2, uh, two power of 2 is 4, so we get just 200 on uh, Newton second, or I'm going to say joules. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and please subscribe. Bye.